Hi friends, uh, this is Dr. Apoor Mehra and uh, I'm going to talk about something which everybody asks, keeps on asking me at this moment of time. Sir, somehow we are not in the right groove for the final kill. You know, uh, I will title this video as How Bad You Want It. So, if you actually know how bad you want to do something, right, you give your 100%. And that 100% that you give transforms you into something bigger. But we are human beings, right? And as human beings, there are some bad days where we just don't want to do anything. How well you handle those bad days will actually decide how good you will do in life. And here comes the line, how bad you want it. So for this feeling of being passionate about achieving your dreams, this feeling that if you do not have it, what's going to happen actually takes a decision on that bad day when you feel like not doing anything, you get up and show. The great uh, Michael Jordan said, I kept on failing till I succeeded, but I never gave up. The great Muhammad Ali said, I never counted till the time it started hurting me, but when it started hurting me. There's a time I started working hard. And the great Michael Phelps said that you have to perform every day because if you give a break of a day, it takes two days to ba get back in the groove. And this is what you should avoid. So that is why if you really want to do something good, ask yourself how bad you want it. And if you have the answer how bad you want it, you will never have a bad day because even on that day, you will show up. You will not count in the beginning. You have to count when it starts hurting. You have to get up every day because a lost day will make you lose two more. And remember, failure is a part of the path of success. Thank you very much.